Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I just finished footing, putting your footing. I just pin it. Oh my god, finished footing on. I can't speak right now. Anyways, I'm not gonna delete this because that's how I roll. If you guys watch my channel, you know I can't speak. Anyways, I just finished putting on this face of makeup and it is the boxy charm of march i tried the cover fx palette yada yada if you want to see that i'll link that down in the description box below anyways i'm warming up and drinking my coffee because i'm always cold even though it's finally warming up outside and it's like 56 no 56 degrees is it like almost 60 degrees outside oh my god and i'm cold i got problems it's been like 30 so yeah I'm going to sip my coffee. It says, I'm a special unicorn. I love collecting coffee cups. That is my thing. I love coffee and coffee cups. Like, I have problems. Anyways, I'm here with you guys today to show you guys. I was just thinking, hmm, you know, I have some products that I just have received in subscription boxes that I'm just not fond of. And I mean, they're products that will probably work for other people with other tastes and stuff or with, you know, better makeup abilities, but they're just not products for me. So I'm going to be showing you guys the few things that I do have here today and they are all high-end products. Anyways, if you're new to my channel, be sure um, to check out my giveaway I have going on right now. There's going to be three winners. You're going to win all kinds of Too Faced stuff and a ColourPop palette. So be sure to check that out. I'll link that down below as well. And yeah, I'm sorry if I keep looking at this way because there's a mirror over there. So I just have to look at myself. Anyways, the first thing that we have that just didn't work out for me was this Butter London Stroke Wow Roll-On Precision Liner. And yeah, so I like my eyeliner very precise and this just doesn't do it for me. Um, I'm going to show you guys. This is the little pod it comes in we'll say and there's the very tiny roller um it is very odd to use it doesn't come out like you know what i didn't want to swatch anything on me because i just took a shower but here we go like it doesn't look too bad on my hand but like it's so straight, like, it's so hard to work with, and the formula is not too, like, I mean, it's black, but it's, like, really wet, I believe. If you used this and had, like, some type of, like, regular, like, brush-to-do eyeliner, you could probably really make this work. But just the roller, it doesn't work for me. I don't know, if you practice with it, you probably could make a cool wing. I don't know how you'd fill it in with this, but, like... Yeah, this is definitely a different product, and I got eyeliner on my nail. And this is just one that I just, I can't use. I will not be using that. Next, we have this, and I received this recently, this Hikari, Hikari? Hikari? Hikari. I really don't know how to say it. Anyways, this is a lip and cheek stick in the, in, yeah, in the shade Dust. Oh my god. And it's Dusk. I always say Dust. I have problems, like... I see letters that aren't there. Anyways, this is the big stick right here. And just, you know, I haven't even used this, but this is why it's not working for me, guys. Bright red. Bright red. And, um, yeah, I think this came in a lip monthly, and they always send these bright, bright reds, like, all the time. Like, they will send you, like, four reds in one month. Like, really, I do not need this many hot red lipsticks. Um, and I would definitely not use this on my cheeks. It's just not, I like more of a peachy shade. This is not for me. Um, so maybe I will pass this on to somebody that would appreciate that. But literally, I haven't swatched it. I don't want to. I don't want to, like, waste product that I know I won't be using. No shade thrown at the company. If this was in a different shade, then, you know, I would use it. But that's, I just can't do that. So next we have, ironically, I know, it's beautiful. The packaging is amazing. I'm not knocking the packaging. This, um, yeah, Rainforest of the Sea Volume 3 palette by Tarte. I always want to say Amazon of the Sea because they have the Amazonian clay um, blush. Anyways, this has a nice big mirror. It's compact. It's very sturdy. But these shades, um, when I'm looking to do my eyeshadow, if you guys follow my channel, you know I like some colorful, like crazy out there looks. And these are just too 
darn neutral for me and there's not enough mattes as well in this palette um honestly if i have a friend that will like i've used it one time so if i have a friend that'll take this off my hands i'll definitely give it to them if they want it because i've barely used it and this is such a nice like little compact like cute thing if these are your shades then this is like all you need like you can take this to go but like i said i need something with some pigment and yeah next we have this little smashbox um it says be Leg be legendary pucker up a lipstick palette in the shade neutral so it shows here's the front for you and it's like holographic you guys can see it there boom 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 and on the back it shows all of your shades um i don't know like the shades are very pretty and it has a mirror at the top so i'm gonna cover the mirror the shades are very pretty but it's just not oh i hope i don't get that eyeliner on my shirt it's just not like the formula i look for i mean this i would probably bring on a trip to you know so i don't know to travel with or anything because uh, oh my gosh i'm getting so tongue tied i would bring this on a trip you guys to travel with even though it's not my favorite formula because you do get a few different kind like nice shades in there and different colors but this isn't like my everyday go-to like lip thing right here but i mean i i'm not knocking this product um i'm not saying i would give this away either it's just one of those things that it's like, I might use it. Like, I don't know. It's something easy to travel with. So, like, if you're trying to do makeup and have a few different looks, like, I'm going to be bringing this. So, I'm not knocking it. I'm not throwing shade at that. So, and I know, you guys, I'm having my coffee. I'm a little wound up. I'm sorry I can't talk. Worse than usual because I say that every video. Almost. I'm exaggerating. And I'm sorry for slipping my coffee like that. Anyways, I will be getting a backdrop don't mind my mess back there it's not really a mess it's just like craziness because i have so much crap anyways last thing is the tardiest pro glow palette and again this packaging is amazing i don't know what it is with me and tart um when you open it it opens like this and i know you guys can see it has two mirrors so i'm going to hide those mirrors hide your wife and that's what we're working with. I have tried this out a few times because it just, it seems like it's a great palette. But like this shade down here is a cream contour. This does not work for me. It makes me look dirty. It looks horrible. It, it looks muddy on me. Maybe on a different skin tone, you know. I wish they would have included a few different contour shades. And then here's a different contour. Again, this one's just too light for me. So it's like... There's nothing that really works in here for me besides the highlighters that are up top. Um, yeah, so this is a really nice palette. It's really sturdy. It has the two mirrors on the sides that fold out. But it's just like, I can't use it for contouring. So would I bring this to travel? No, because it's really heavy and I don't really get a lot of use out of this. This is something that I would pass on, honestly, just because it doesn't work for my skin tone. So... You know, if you're more, I feel like I have a more of like an orangey undertone and stuff like, and I'm white, white. My niece is like pretty tan and has that like olive skin. That would probably work for her, like that contour shade, the cream contour. It's, it just depends, you know, it depends on a lot of things. And I have acne and not smooth skin as well. So cream contours are not my thing really. Anyways those are the products i'm not too fond of that i have received in um like fab fit fun lip monthly and boxy charm so i'll hold those up for you guys like i said some of them will work sometimes but like like these two not knocking them but like these three yeah they can go anyways thank you guys for watching and again be sure to check out my giveaway adios amigos let me set everything down. You know what? I'm going to keep talking to you guys. Are you guys listening? You know what? We're going to do like a video where I just talk and get ready with you guys. And just like have my morning because I'm most talkative in mornings. Even though it's not the morning right now. Um, I have things to do. Yeah. I should be cleaning. And if you guys are still watching this, I really love you. Comment down below if you hung in here and comment like something like... I don't know, like, 
that you love my vans because yes i can't believe you watched this whole video guys thank you guys for being such good subscribers i know i'm a doof when i have caffeine and again adios